Katrine Svensson, La Gringa. How does a PhD from MIT end up as the chief chemist of the Santa Blanca cartel? Like all cynics, she started out as an idealist. La Gringa came to Bolivia to help the people. The poor, the downtrodden, the sick. She loved them, and they loved her. Working for an NGO called Hands Over Bolivia, she did research to develop a new vaccine for yellow fever. It was meant to be produced easier and cheaper, making it more readily available to more people in a shorter time. Then, disaster struck. She lost all her funding and was vilified by the scientific community. Of course, La Gringa hadn't been involved in the scandal, but it didn't matter. She lost everything. After that, well, you know what? Thanks to the NSA's prison program, we can hear it in her own words. How much did you earn, Sonrisa? 40,000 a year. I spend more on my dogs. I will pay you a hundred times what you are making. To do what? Quality control. Working from Okoro, you can develop the best, most potent, most pure cocaine in the world. I came here to help people survive. La gringa, my darling. How do you think the people survive? Desperate people make desperate mistakes. And I had made El Yayo and La Gringa desperate. I pressured them too much. But I had no choice. The attacks on our production were increasing. It was hurting our supply chain. If something was not done, we would lose our market share. So I pushed them to produce more coke. They couldn't do it. So they started to cut it, dilute it, lower the quality to increase the quantity. An understandable mistake, but a mistake nevertheless. I had spent years branding Santa Blanca, a quality product, the best in the world, a primo price for a primo product. Problem was the product wasn't primo anymore. And someone had to pay for that. El Sueño's discovered that La Gringa's been cutting the purity of her cocaine, and he sent his people to kill her. Get to La Gringa and bring her in. She's got nowhere else to go. Atari's rebels are defending La Gringa's house. The fuck's going on here? companies into places like Italy and Japan. Places that weren't exactly enemies, but weren't quite allies. Ballet, man. Like, with ballerinas and those pointy shoes and everything. But if you dump ballet instead of bringing biochemistry science types to Bolivia, we wouldn't be dealing with all these advances in cocaine technology. But 
told those sueños she'd have a new state-of-the-art coke lab up and running. But you guys I'm good? thinking she Damn, promised El Jefe more than she can handle. She's about two weeks behind Whip schedule, down, and she is looking stressed out. You know, her hair's all in knots, not bathing and stuff. I mean, she is scared shitless of El Sueño, so my money's on her having something to give him on her deadline. But... I also know that you don't have real warm feelings for this chick, so if you want me to make sure she misses that deadline, I am capable of a little bit of sabotage. I'll talk later. And make sure those kids in the activity have their March Madness brackets finished. None of these cartel guys watch college basketball, so I'm gambling with you guys. Who are you? What do you want? We're your way out of this mess, understand? But we gotta move right fucking now. I won't get far. Not like this. I know someone. He lives in a village not far from here. The rebels, they take their wounded to him when they can. How well do you know that rebel doctor? He won't talk to the cartel. If that's what you're afraid of. They don't scare him. He's the bravest guy I know. We met when I was working with the NGO. The fake NGO. He was the local guy. And a few years and a few tons of coke later, he introduces you to the rebels. He needed medicine and vaccines. I had the money. I don't get you. What do you get out of playing both sides? Oh, hell if I know. I came to Bolivia to help people. That's all I was trying to do. I'll drive. Hold on, Gringa. We've still got a ways to go. I don't know about that. I'm going, going into it. Oh. Is she gonna make it? She better. What were rebels doing protecting your house? That guitar must have sent them. To protect me. I feel cold. I'm starting to feel cold. Why would Pat Katari protect a cartel scientist like you? Uh. I've been using Swainio's money to buy medical supplies for the rebels. Pack didn't... I can't. Please. I've got to stop. Don't quit on me now, lady. Sight's just up ahead. Who are you? What do you want? You know this woman? What happened? Believe me, Doc, it's better if you don't know. She's got a GSW to the shoulder. Can you help her? Si, por supuesto. Leave her with me. I'll do everything I can. We'll buy you all the time we can, but you need to work fast. I got a feeling Sueño's not done with her yet. Hola. I'll call Pat Katari for some reinforcements. Copy that, compa. Troops on the way. Contact. Sueño sent another crew after us. Take them down. Helicopter inbound.
Frag out. We've given the doc all the time we can. One way or another, we're getting La Gringa out of here. Okay, Gringa, time to go. Please, just give me a minute. He stopped the bleeding, but I got a ball of lead in my shoulder. The cocktail the doc just gave you? I bet you can't even feel your face, let alone that bullet. You got me there. We're leaving. You feel like you're gonna keel over or puke, just look at the horizon. It'll keep you steady. It's called tactical field care. Stop being such a pussy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here, open it. Open it. Her extract is ten minutes out. Oh, fucking hell. I'll be glad to be rid of this whiny bitch. Your little clinic might have bought you some redemption with the rebels, but that crap doesn't play for me. But with a set of lungs like yours, you're gonna be a big hit in prison. Why don't you just let me die? The thought had crossed my mind. But five years from now, ten, hell, maybe even fifty years from now, when I'm so old I can't even wipe my own ass, it's gonna make me happy to think of little Mousy Lagringa and all those nasty friends she made in prison. I don't care. I'm happy to go to your prison. A lifetime, ten lifetimes in prison is better than Sueño. Your worst could never compare to his. 